Hi friends, today we are going to talk about how we can do, uh, suppose I just know a vendor number and I don't really know which are the different tables the vendor number is stored or it has a purchase order or it has invoices or anything. I really don't know. Only thing I know it's a vendor number in SAP and it's the field is a vendor. Okay, so how can I do it? So I go to SE16T. Uh, which is this transaction and then I can go to SE16SO and I'll execute here and here I will just need to put I'll just put paste and here I'll just put vendor and here I'll just put this suppose this the vendor number I have okay and I'll just execute okay I don't have authorization here so now what I'm going to do is I'll make sure I'll put I'll try to trick the system and do a debug with change okay so let me go and I'll do slash h and I'll execute and and in this way you will also know how to do a debug with change okay so here I'll click create go to message and if you have the authorization this doesn't it's not required it will be smooth so I'll just execute here I am so I'll put the breakpoint here and I'll save it and I'll execute and this will come and now after that I'll execute again because I'll just trick the system and I'll put size of our C equals zero and here I have it ready and now I execute now if it, it's it will take some time because it's going through so you can see all the tables are getting scanned here and the moment everything every data will come we'll see so here you can see all this table has this number as a vendor okay now let's see what you're talking about ac docker that's the biggest thing everyone is talking about ac docker okay that has that let's see where is that field located okay so we can do a search we'll do go to here and we'll click on change layout okay and we'll click vendor vnd okay and i'll do a search and i click here and here you can see that this is the vendor number so all these 233 entries are there okay so for ac docker now the next one is we are going to go hit the back button there are other things so12 mad doc you name it msec ekpa ekpa is related with partner ekkio and then we have purchase info record. Then you have statistics for vendor evaluation. Then you have receipt. All these tables you probably wouldn't have known, but now you know. So some of the tables that are very interesting would be CVI vend link, which is brand new. LFA one, LFP one is the same. And these are all the tables. So based on the number of tables there is and the type of table, you can for sure see that they have done invoices, they have done purchasing, it has purchase orders, it has purchase info records, it has batches, it has partner information, and of course it's a vendor, and other things, okay? So this is very, 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 very useful, okay? So that's it, uh, so this covers the thing. So again, the transaction code is SE16T, or you can always go from here, it at one go the transaction code is se 60 sl okay that's it stay tuned to my sap channel and happy sap learning and have a great